Zack Roloff lashes out at his father Matt over who will take over the family's farm in a sneak peek of the premiere. Matt recently revealed that he put the farm up for sale despite his son expressing interest in buying a portion of the property. In a trailer for Tuesday season's premiere, the father-son duo disagrees about the future of the famed attraction. At one point in the clip, Zack opens up about his and his wife Tori's decision to make an offer on the north side of the farm, which his father owns. However, the role of patriarch isn't too keen on his son's proposition, claiming that the 32-year-old didn't come in to negotiate, he came in to demand. The clip flashes to Zack with his arms crossed, seeming annoyed at his dad's response as the pair stood on the foundation. He then voices his frustration in a confessional interview, where he accuses the 60-year-old of trying to make money off his own family. The Little People Big World star angrily tells the camera, Are you trying to make money off your own family, or do you want this legacy that you've preached about for 10 years? Mad sex wife Amy admits that she's not shocked by her son's falling out with his father. The feud, however, is upsetting to Zack, who expresses his desire to break this cycle. Amy seems to agree, later telling the cameras, things have changed, things aren't going back. Things still appear to be tense as Zack slammed his father on social media on Sunday. Following the news of Matt putting the home on the market, the father of four detailed the difficult decision in a lengthy Instagram post. He explained his reasoning behind the sale, claiming his twin boys could not work together towards a possible joint sale. Zack's twin brother Jeremy previously expressed interest in purchasing a part of the farm, though that also didn't materialize. Matt claimed that Jeremy and Zack decided individually that the timing was not right for them to purchase a part of the farm at this time. He mentioned that the difficult decision was made to continue towards his retirement goals. Besides Jeremy and Zack, the reality star also shares Jacob and daughter Molly with his ex-wife Amy. In the comments section, Zack accused his father of manipulating the narrative right before the season premieres on May 17th. He argued that Matt was not taking responsibility for his own actions and blaming others. Zack slammed his father's new shocking law of cowardice and manipulation of his family and kids for his own gain. Matt announced the sale of the Oregon pumpkin farm last week. According to the Wall Street Journal, Matt has asked for about $4 million with the sale of the original family home and bright red barn. LBBW fans jumped at the comment section and slammed the TV personality for not selling the property to his offspring. One fan brought up Matt's children and asked, none of the kids wanted to buy it. Matt responded, they all had more than enough and very fair chances. In March, Matt had planned on retiring and spending more time at his vacation home in Arizona with his girlfriend Karen Chandler. A source close to the TV star told The Sun, Matt would prefer Jacob and his wife Isabel to take over the farm, but he's not sure they are on board at the moment. He is the youngest son, but Matt knows Jacob has potential. They are on the farm a lot, and Matt thinks this is a good way to teach him a lot of things he needs to learn. Zack has also mentioned taking over the farm, and Jeremy has said in the past he would like it, so Matt is still kind of stuck on what the next steps are, but he would prefer Jacob. Matt is on good terms with all of his sons, and Jeremy has been working on making the pumpkin season for visitors, but the situation of who will take over the farm is still an issue yet to be resolved. Meanwhile, Zack has kept busy as his wife gave birth to their third child on April 30th. Their son Josiah welcomes the couple's two other children, son Jackson and daughter Lila. The family recently celebrated their oldest child's birthday with a massive backyard party at their Washington home. That's it for now, thank you for watching. Please subscribe to stay tuned.